Okay, I just want to do a quick video of the 1CR. I know we've already seen this machine, but uh, yeah, I just kind of want to do a video of the carpet tracks that these classics leave behind. These are real, real good machines. This one has been converted to the HEPA bags. See, I think we've got a newer four row brush in this one. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, these classics, uh, they're pretty hard to beat. You know, they're, they're heavy enough where when you go to do your handle, it's not going to pick up that front end. Uh, that's kind of an issue sometimes we can have with the, like the Sanitronics and stuff. The front end kind of, sometimes it wants to lift, when, lift up when you're pulling back. Uh, in this classic, you, you've got enough weight in the front end, and then on top of that, your handle is a little further back, which also helps keep that front end lower. Uh, and these things, they're, they're just such good cleaners. I mean, of all the vintage Kirby's uh, to vacuum with, it's hard to beat these classics. I, you know, I. I know that's that's arguable, but uh, I don't know. These these are just really really good machines. Lots of power, and they push really easy. I mean, they look heavy, but they're not uh, that bad at all. I don't think anyway. But yeah, we'll fire it up and see what it does. I've already done a little vacuuming, but we'll kind of show you some of the carpet tracks it leaves. Yeah, I just love the way these groom the carpet. That heavy head in the front stays planted down and grooms things nice, deep cleans. Definitely uh, would recommend a classic if you guys are going to, you know, daily use an older Kirby. These are hard to beat. They really are. And I, I personally think they push just as easy as like a Sanatronic. I mean, I really don't feel any difference. They're a little heavier to lift, but pushing it is actually really easy. So, um, I mean, they're all great. You know, these are awesome, uh, you know, 516 through D80s. Oh, they're hard to beat, but
Uber convertible's hard to beat. Even that Royal, uh, they're all good. But, you know, I would say all around the classic 1CR, classic Omega, classic 3, tradition, those models are hard to beat. Uh, once they got to the Heritage, uh, the rug plate was so skinny on the bottom. And that made them really hard to push. Uh, they would kind of drag on the car, but they were great machines. But uh, the wider rug plate on these is just so nice to uh, to push for sure. Anyway, just uh, testing out my new camera to see how it works. So thanks for watching.